Penzance Harbour Modernisation Project is looking to improve the, the visibility of Penzance Harbour. It's looking to remove vehicles off the road on Wharf Road to increase the safety of the road and the persons using it. It's also looking to add additional facilities into Penzance such as the boat lift facility with the environmental washdown and a pontoon facility to accept cruise ship tenders. The harbour is a really small space that has to cope with an awful lot of stuff going on, not least um, two ferries running out to Scilly. Um, what this project does is going to free up um, the land side um, so that it becomes a pleasant place where visitors, people from the local community can actually enjoy and experience the harbour. But at the same time, perhaps more importantly, it means the harbour can be more efficient. Um, so the engineering works, which are currently really not fit for purpose, will be refurbished, moved in the harbour. That means they'll be able to employ more people, perhaps introduce more apprenticeships into the business. Um, the whole of the harbour operation um, for the ferry service out, and the freight service out to the Sillies will be much more efficient um, and there will be less lorry traffic on the road. Visually uh, over on the slipway we're having a boat lift facility and the washdown facility so that will improve flexibility for visiting boats, uh, for commercial vessels, the smaller ones up under 16 tonnes. Uh, and then underneath the rank building here, we're going to have a pontoon facility, which will accept cruise ship tenders. It will accept uh, visiting yachts and also commercial vessels uh, running passengers on day trips. Behind me here, uh, we've got the green sheds and the waterside meadery. A lot of people will have noticed that recently the Boston shed has been declad. Uh, that was done on pure safety grounds after a storm passed through and ripped some of the cladding off. So that has been declad and the proposal is to take that down and that will be off-site parking for HGV vehicles. The Waterside Meadry, uh, as part of Town Deal, will be taken down and that will become a freight loading and unloading facility. And the Penwith Marine Services Building will be repurposed as a dedicated freight facility for the Isles of Scilly. That opens up the harbour to public realm and creates a, a better space for everyone around. The benefits that you'll see within the harbour will future-proof the harbour for, for many years to come. The Steamship Group delivers 15,000 tonnes of freight annually to the Isles of Scilly. Uh, because of the current infrastructure here and the lack of storage, um, we can only accept freight on Monday mornings, Wednesday mornings, Friday mornings. That creates a significant backlog of vehicles um, along the harbour front. What we're hoping is, is that this investment and potential to increase uh, the cargo storage capacity on the harbour uh, will open up um, capacity and allow many more local suppliers to deliver to the, to the company. Recreational boat users typically do not have deep pockets, so the investment that we see tends to be around the larger marinas. So when we see investment of things such as boat lifts, it will add a tremendous amount. Um, one of the benefits from boat lift is that we have the ability to take boats in and out of the water very quickly. Um, if you have a problem, for example, we could take the boat out, have it inspected, put the boat back if it's not a problem. If we didn't have a boat lift, then we're reliant upon cranes, the availability of cranes, the cost of cranes. Um, a boat lift also, which is a, a, a big advantage nowadays, allows us to have a washdown facility. So for the environmental side of things, we could take the boat out, wash down all the stuff that's on the bottom of the boat and ensure that that is safely disposed of away, which is for Penzance will be a massive benefit for the harbour quality.